this bed by myself. Good night. What's up guys? Welcome back to this is Brian's World. Today we're at the airport again, but this time it's not only two people. There's a little couple monkeys over here with us again. Traveling five. We're checking out this uh, airport right now at Newark. Here's Bella. Hi. We are at the, uh, Terminal A, United uh, Airlines. So we're gonna check out United again for uh, traveling from New York to California and John Wayne. Now we're gonna go in security. We just drop off the bag. This place, this terminal is new. They just finished building this place. So we're gonna witness this thing together. Uh, at Terminal A and traveling with a family of five going from here to California so if you're excited like we are I am super excited and I am ready to go so before we do hit that like share and subscribe and we're gonna go in right now let's go all right we about to go in drop off these luggage Luckily, he's not overweight. Wow, as you can see, Terminal A, they, they did all these new renovations. Looks pretty nice. And uh, this is the check-in line over here. Wow, they have the monitors and everything over here. And as uh, if you have a TSA pre-check-in, you can check in right now. Everything looks very nice and upgraded but this security line looks humongous my gosh all right all right let us uh, go into the security and then i will get back to you guys because this line looks super long look at where we're going how long is the line we're gonna go down it looks like it's an endless sea of human All right, one thing I just found out, if you guys are gonna fly United, uh, please do the pre-check-in on United. It's called, uh, what, what was that? TSA, yes, pre-check-in. And whatever the airline that you guys are going for, pre-check-in on them. That is, before you have to wait all these lines like us. <laughs> or do clear, pay clear. Clear is not, I don't know how much is it, but if you're flying a lot, you should think about that. But security is moving, not so bad. Okay, we're finally getting to mid part right here. But if you guys did the TSA, there's another line that you go directly and then you don't have to wait. Yeah, I think he's gonna let us in. Go, go, go. Olivia, let's go this way. <laughs> Down here. This is so crazy. I will tell you guys in a few minutes after we get to the terminal. Hopefully, we get to the terminal.
finally we're here about to board and we are inside here is the extra leg room as you guys can see my knee and that is still not so bad got the screen in the front uh, the kids enjoying them there right right now before we actually head out uh, they got the fold-out table but it can't fold that's the one thing it's a big piece <laughs> these kids are loving it Yeah, but uh, the way to get in here was crazy for us. We almost got left behind, <laughs> but we're on here. Thank God, everybody's seating now. We're about to fly out. These kids are having a little snack and uh, preparing ourselves to get going. So as you can see, the, the leg room is not so bad. As you see on my wife, she can put a bag down there not so bad so the configuration of this plane is uh, they only have 12 seat for the business class or first class and then over here is the extra leg room in the back is a 3-3 configuration um, on this side and uh, of course <laughs> these kids are loving it <laughs> look at my boy <laughs> yeah now we're chilling now we're flying out guys <laughs> Of course, they give you a complimentary drinks. You can get coffee, you can get soda. I got both. So, soda first, and then I even got coffee next, as you can see this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here's some coffee. And the coffee is actually not so bad. It's from Dunkin' Donut. And some cream, and we're good to go. Mm. Mix it up, and you get a pretty good coffee. <laughs> Oh, I needed this coffee. It was so good. Yeah. Now, sit back, relax, but this entertainment system has been like this the whole flight. Can't even use it. So we gotta look out the window like my kids. That's all you got for entertainment. <laughs> On here. So now, we are flying to LA. So we got LA now. All right, we finally landed. Oh, that was a, a little rough landing, I would say. But I will tell you guys more. Now we're gonna go get the luggage. Let's go. All right, let me uh, talk to you guys while I'm walking to the pickup luggage anyway. I'm going to give you guys some insight of flight. I couldn't talk that much because we were such in a rush before. Uh, <laughs> uh, we went to the wrong, I guess, uh, gate. And uh, we have to take the transit to the other gate. So that was one crazy, crazy thing. Because on the app, it's told, it told us to go to Terminal A, but it's actually in Terminal C. And we were like, oh my gosh, we have to go get. It. Well, luggage claims over here. Hold on, hold on. Let me get back to you right now. So back at it guys, uh, the flight on uh, United this time was a little bit disappointing, I would say. I just went on a recent trip from New York to uh, Houston just recently. That plane I feel like is newer. This plane I feel like is a lot dated. I would say United, please, please update this plane. I don't get it because this one the plane is flying longer hours the other one is flying shorter hours and the other one is so much better um we got a bit to the the extra leg room um but our luggage when we were checking in they forced us to you know put our carry-on as check-in that's one thing that was uh, kind of like crazy for us because we have a lot of stuff for the kids as well and then we have to take some out and then we have to check in one of our bags. Luckily, we have one bag that have all the laptop and all the, the, the iPad for them to be chilling on this flight. If not, it would be bonker. 
So that's one first thing that I experienced. Oh, uh, that it was, was a, kind of like a shit show. You would say, very, very. And now uh, we are praying because we uh, we checked in on the other terminal, so we're praying that our luggage is gonna be here on time. So we don't even know. Ah, oh, man, that was hard. So one thing about the entertainment system on the flight as well, it was bad. The whole ride, there was none for six hours. The whole entertainment was messed up. This was, you can't even play it. So you, luckily, you have the iPad and your phone. If not, you would be, you don't know what to do. That that was one thing. So United, please okay, change that plane to the other plane, okay? <laughs> Uh, but other than that, the leg room was a little bit smaller than the one that we went in last time too as well. Um, and uh, yeah, everything else was a little old and dated, so not so great. <laughs> now we gotta go pick up our car, get this luggage, hopefully it arrived. Let's see. It's coming out now. My wife is praying right now that the luggage come because if not, we are so screwed. And I know my thing is damaged. The carry-on, mmm, I'm so sad. About luggage. Oh yeah. Pray it is here. having the joy we got our luggage ah, yeah all right so now we gotta go look for the car uh checking it out over here at the toro app again let's go all right waiting for the elevator okay let's go oh my god <laughs> That was uh, a rough searching. We walked, we found our car, and here it is, right here. What? Is the new X7 2023. Now let's unlock this car. The tour is pretty cool. So when you press this, you can unlock the car now. Let's see it work. It needs like a couple seconds over here. But here is the new X7 in gray this one is like uh, i think it's called brooklyn gray oh yes it's open 2023 x7 let's uh, give you a quick tour around the car how it is bella and look at this beauty this car look mighty fine this is the new headlights as you can see over here that's the new headlight. My car right now at home is a little different. The headlight is all crossed. This one is split it out two-way. You see the head on top, on the bottom. But yeah, we got it. All right, so that is the X7 2023. Hopefully, this is the car that uh, we might change to. Not sure, but uh, let me put all these luggage inside right now. My, my wife thought that we got that uh, GMC. She has a little bit of, uh, but then I got her dream car. Oh, sorry. So what do you think, babe? Should we get it? It's so nice. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I know. I, I, I meant to do that. Let's see inside these kids. Here is inside. Look. Wow. And they got the captain chair as well. All right, guys. Give you a little insight on how the interior is. 
look this screen is beautiful this is like they say the 12 inch screen that connect through uh, the gauge as well and i love the new key look at this key this bmw key looks mighty fine and the gear shift is different mine is like taller and this one is smaller but this car is so cool but this little light on on this side as well and now there's not a lot of i would say a lot of button over here they took that away and this control thing is for the air vent pretty cool all right now we gotta go find something to eat. let's go Alright guys, we are at this location called Hai Lu. It's a Vietnamese hou tiu. It's like a noodle. Uh, I would say like a pork, pork based noodle. Uh, clear noodle. It's, I think it's really good. Really good. So I'm going to take you guys in there and check it out too as well. Let's go. <music> so excited I am in the restaurant we are like so hungry super hungry right now so we got to go order some food uh, and let you guys see how it is this is supposed to be a traditional Vietnamese like noodle it's called hong tiu clear noodle or it could be like kind of like rice noodle as well so I am excited to have this bowl right now super super hungry and uh, just give you guys a little share of my experience with the X5, I mean X7, just right now. One thing that I didn't like is the kind of like the changing gear. It, I'm so used to my car with the handle. This one, they'd have that this little kind of like knob, like you're going up and down. That's the one thing that uh, I don't really like it that much on that. But everything else, the car is super comfortable, super nice. I guess it's like a brand new car. It just feels so nice in there. I like it. I like it. Maybe we'll see if we're gonna get that car. But as of right now, we are loving the experience so far. So after this, we're gonna have this food, and then we're gonna check in the hotel and let you guys see how the hotel is. Yeah, let's enjoy. Ooh, soda lemonade. So good. This is um, passion fruit. Mm. Yum, yum. Oh, here is the noodle. Look at that. So good. So this is uh, it's called Saigon Mi Gong. Mm, look at that. Yum, yum, huh? My wife got this one for the kids. They have soup in there and it's raw. But same thing, but bro. See what we got inside. So you got the pork over here. It's like roast pork. Oh, I love this. This is like pork fat right here. And then there's a noodle. Mmm. This noodle looks good. And they do give you a side bowl of noodle. Pork soup. Alright guys, bon appetit. There's mint beef in here. Mint pork or mint? Yeah, yeah pork. Let's try it. Yeah. Mmm, no, it's good. But, huh? Can I have some chili? This is like vinegar chili. Drop some of that on top. Mmm. What's on that, too, it? All right, let's try them now. Mm. I don't know if I'm hungry. This one. This is a mighty good bow. Mm. Like they, they don't cheap out on the veggie. It's just, they gave us so much veggie over here. Mm. Mm. 
All right, let's try this broth out. Ooh, wow, super sweet. Sweet like, like, you know, like pork. Thank you. Mm. Sweetness from the bone. But I feel like um, this one has a little bit uh, seafood as well, like shrimp or something. They have, they added in here, in the broth, but excellent. Look at my wife chopping up so many bowls for these little kids. All right. You kids, when you're watching this video, you got to remember, okay? Mommy's taking care of you. Bella, how you like the noodle? Mmm, is it good? Yum, yum. <laughs> Mm. All right, I'm gonna enjoy this, guys. I'm gonna see you guys at the hotel. Let's give you a quick tour on that. See you in a bit. <laughs> All right, guys, we just got out. Oh, I am super, super full. Cool. This is uh, Hai Lu, Hai Lu restaurant. So, if you guys are in Cali, you want to go check out their place for noodle. Uh, just give you my feedback of it. The noodle, the soup was just a little sweet on my taste, but everything else was great. So, if you guys have a chance, go check them out. Now, we're going to head out to our hotel and let you guys check it out. Let's go. All right, so we are at the hotel, guys. Now we gotta check in. The hotel now is called Vit Hotel. Before it used to be something else. Okay, look at this. This is the lobby. Pretty cool, huh? Now we gotta go check in and go get our room. All right, we got our room key. Let's go. You guys ready to go to the room? Yeah. yeah. All right, we are finally here. We have checked into the room, and here is a quick tour. This is the bathroom. Here's a tub. Here's a double sink vanity. Beautiful. We have been at this hotel before. If you guys watch our vlog, uh, I would say a year ago, two years ago. This a year ago was it? Okay, so here why we like this hotel because you got the double queen size bed plus this two bunk bed for the kids. Look at that. They love it. This room is nice for our family. And here is the view in the back. If there's any view, nope, there's no view. There is a a little view, say, and that's that. And this is the hotel room. All right, guys, that is a wrap for today. Where I am super tired. We have went through a lot traveling with three kids, running through the airport like a maniac just to get to our gate. We almost got left behind because we went to the wrong terminal. Because on the app, like I said, it told us Terminal A and Newark. That was a nice terminal we went to. We love that terminal. But then all of a sudden, they changed it from gate A20 to gate C113. So we have to go that down, take the bus, go back to uh, Terminal C. And that was like bare small margin for us to get on. And then when we got on all our carry-on they wanted to check it in oh, we're like, oh my god that was a nightmare because we have a lot of stuff and then my my small carry-on over here i never checked in i never checked in before and i have, I have checked in and that thing busted up a little bit at that but uh yeah it was it was a trip united this time i had to say um, I, I the experience was a little bit chaotic, and the airplane was a little bit old. But uh, that's that. We are here. That's the main thing. Whatever it is, 
we are good. There's we're no good. Baby Yoda. Now we're gonna have fun. Now the journey will begin. What's up, California? We are here, Disneyland. Of course, that's where we're gonna be. We're gonna check out, I guess, as many restaurants as we could and explore California. So come along with us. Ha uh, yeah. We're gonna have fun, family, and I will see you guys tomorrow or uh, next time. Peace out and be good. Love you guys. Books. Chill. All right. This is the bed. I am gonna sleep on this bed by myself. Good nighty night. And there is their bed. They're gonna go sleep soon. Say bye bye, Olivia. Bye -bye.